using a band-aid. Hello, it's Jackie. And I am sure that at some point of time we have all had one of these, a band-aid. In this video, we're gonna look and find out how to put a band-aid on. Let's take a look. There are lots of different types of band-aids. There are regular ones, large ones, waterproof ones, and even extra wide ones. They may all be different, but they all do the same thing. Band-aids have two parts. One is a gauze pad, which is right in the middle of the band-aid. This is the part that we put right on top of our injury and it helps to protect our injury from germs and helps our injury heal. We should never touch the gauze pad with our fingers. The other part of the band-aid is the sticky part. This is the part that sticks to our skin so that the band-aid doesn't move. We never put this part over our injury. We use band-aids when our skin has been hurt, like from a cut or a fall. Band-aids stop germs from getting into our injury and this helps our injury heal. Band-aids are also good for when we get blisters on our feet. If your injury is bleeding, always try to stop or slow down the bleeding before putting the band-aid on. You can do this with an antiseptic wipe or some paper towel. You will need to press the wipe or towel onto the bleeding and keep pressing for a short while and then put the band-aid on. To open the band-aid, find the top part of the band-aid that says pull and has an arrow. This is the part you need to hold with your two thumbs and pull your thumbs away from each other. When you have taken the band-aid out of the cover, turn it over and you will see there are two covers on the back of the band-aid. If you bend the band-aid, one of the covers will open and you can easily peel that one off. With one of the back covers now off and you holding the sticky part of the band-aid, look for the injury and place the gauze pad part right on top of that injury. Now the gauze pad is on your injury, it's time to start pressing the sticky part to your skin. Use a finger to press it down so that it stays in place. Now that half of the band-aid is on, you need to take off the other back cover on the band-aid and press the rest of the sticky part onto your skin. Once you have put your band-aid on, always remember to put the covers and the paper or the wipe that you have used into the bin.